Uh, a lot of people have been asking me about this. Um, so I figured I'd just make a video and explain. I've been telling everybody lately, I'm, I'm not going to be giving to homeless people or needy children or anything this holiday season. Um, and everybody's been like, why, why, you know, why? Um, it's because I'm giving to all the tech workers that got laid off. Um, and I do have pretty good and like sound reasoning for that. So I could just run through it with you real quick. Um, first of all, homeless people don't really contribute anything of value to society. Not like the tech workers and like uh, the content moderators and stuff like that. They actually keep us safe from ourselves. Um, is there some stuff I just have no business saying or th even thinking? And they're the guys that step in and they're like, no, no, hey, stop it. Um, and what that does is that adds value to society. Homeless people don't do that. Another reason is uh, getting laid off is actually worse than being homeless because homeless people are used to it. They're homeless every day. So they wake up and they're homeless. They're like, this is normal. This is the same shit I was doing yesterday. But for the tech workers, uh, it's scary. That might actually be the brokest that they've ever been. So it's really scary. So it, it is a lot worse, actually. Um, another thing is they just work way harder. They work way harder than homeless people. And if you look at the statistics and the facts, um, productivity stayed up when they were working from home. It was just as good. They were doing a great job and working hard. So don't say that it wasn't just as good when they were working from home, because it, it was. It was really good. Uh, another thing is that in America, we have this thing called class mobility. And so basically what that means is that all the hardest working homeless people, they're eventually gonna get up to that level that the tech workers are at anyway. So with that same reasoning, we can uh, deduce that a lot of those tech workers probably used to be homeless. Um, so that's why we should give them victim mobility the same way that we give them class mobility um, because they already, they know what it's like to be homeless. So they are kind of like homeless people. Um, they're just the ones that worked hard and did, did something with their life. Um, none of this has anything to do with media narrative or anything or anything going on on Twitter. Um, this is actually a big tragedy. Some of these people might not find a job that matches their salary and their benefits for up, up to two to three months, potentially even. So this is really scary and I think we need to take action. Sure, we could do what we do every year and just give a bunch of fucking $15 toys to Salvation Army, um, but they're just gonna break in a couple weeks anyway. What we should really be doing is banding together as a country and giving money to all the, the tech workers who got laid off so that they can give their kids um, a Christmas that shits on our kids' Christmas and brag about it at school and make them feel embarrassed. Um, Cause that's gonna make all, all our kids grind harder and then hopefully one day they can be victims too. Uh, I appreciate you guys tuning in. Think about what I said maybe. Um, and be like me and just open your wallet, open your heart um, to these tech workers. Uh, it's fucked up what's happening in this country. It's fucked up what's happening with Twitter. Um, more people actually got laid off than died in 9-11. So just something to think about. Um, again, I appreciate you guys. Happy Thanksgiving.